us what happened in Uttarakhand. 100 Chinese soldiers reportedly transgressed the line of actual control in the Barahuti sector of Uttarakhand on August 30th. They damaged our infrastructure and left before they could be confronted by our troops. Here's what happened. <laughs> The Chinese army transgressed the line of actual control again, this time in Barahoti, middle sector, Uttarakhand. According to information, Chinese soldiers, approximately 100 in number, including some reportedly on horseback, came approximately 4 kilometers inside Uttarakhand and stayed for about two hours. As soon as the indo tibetan border police personnel deployed in the sector learnt of the transgression, they reached the area, but by then, the Chinese soldiers had gone back. Barahoti, an area approximately 80 square kilometers of grazing ground, has been a bone of contention between India and China since 1954. The Chinese of late have been showing interest in this area and they've been coming up to the area of perception. So there wasn't any face off. But yes, this area has been a bone of contention. It is our area. This, according to experts, is being seen as a tit-for-tat response for patrolling by Indian forces till India's claim line. But the large numbers in which the Chinese troops transgressed the LAC has raised eyebrows. Congress MP Rahul Gandhi took to social media platform Twitter to target the Narendra Modi government. He said the government claims it hits terror at source, but the reality is the Chinese are entering our homes and hitting us. Rahul Gandhi was quoting a report that claimed that the Chinese had not only transgressed in the middle sector after Ladakh, but had also destroyed a bridge, a claim denied by senior government officials. India and China remain engaged in a cold standoff at the line of actual control in eastern Ladakh since May 2020. 20 Indian soldiers led by Colonel Santosh Babu made the supreme sacrifice of their lives pushing back Chinese soldiers in the Galwan area in eastern Ladakh. After 12 rounds of talks, the troops have disengaged from most friction points, but tensions remain at Depsang, Hot Spring and Demchok. From eastern Ladakh in the western sector to Barahoti in the middle sector and Sikkim and Arunachal Pradesh in the eastern sector, China is rapidly building up its infrastructure along the India-China LAC in China's Western Theatre Command, looking after Tibet and Xinjiang. An indication that tensions are set to remain high along the India-China LAC in the foreseeable future. India has not only increased troop deployment in the sector, but has also activated advanced landing grounds to ensure quick deployment and movement of men and material in the area. Bureau report. India Today.